Let's take a closer look of what Fragile X Syndrome is. Santiago's body is made up of millions of tiny structures called cells. Each cell usually contains in its nucleus 23 pairs of chromosomes. These chromosomes are macromolecules which carry genetic information or instructions which tell the cell what to do and how to make his body work. These chromosomes are numbered from 1 to 22 and the 23rd chromosome determines Santiago's sex. Females are identified as XX but since Santiago is a male, he is identified as XY. The instructions carried in the chromosomes are called genes which are called units of heredity because their information is passed from one generation to the next. In this way, Santiago's body works with a combination of instructions inherited from both of his parents. Parents have no control over which genes get passed to their children. The FMR1 gene is responsible of Fragile X syndrome. This gene is located in the X chromosome and it is essential in the normal development of the human brain. The syndrome is caused by a mutation of the FMR1 gene, keeping it from functioning properly. Unlike men, most women that have the fragile X mutation are usually not affected because they have a second X chromosome which functions properly.